With Just in Mind, you can use radio buttons and dynamic panels to add dynamic content to your prototypes. In this example, we will show you how to enable or disable portions of input forms. First of all, create a new web prototype. Then, drag two text box widgets and two radio buttons to the canvas and arrange them as in the example. Write the preferred text in the two boxes. Group the radio buttons together by selecting them, right-clicking within the selection and choosing the option Group. Next, drag a dynamic panel to the canvas and place it below the text boxes and radio buttons. Resize it to match the example. Add a second panel by clicking on the plus button. Go to panel 1 and double-click inside the panel to edit its contents. Drag two checkboxes and two text boxes into the panel and arrange them as in the example. Select all the widgets in panel 1 and copy them. Now, go to panel 2 and paste the widgets, making sure that they are positioned in the same spots as in panel 1. Make both checkboxes uneditable by checking the relevant box in the Properties panel. Next, select the second radio button. Go to the Events tab and add an on-click and Set Active Panel event. Select Panel 1 as the Active Panel and click OK. Back to the canvas, select the first radio button. Go to the Events tab and add another on-click and Set Active Panel event. This time, select Panel 2 as the Active Panel. Click OK. And that's it! Click Simulate to view and interact with your prototype.